Hello everyone, today we are digging into Code 7, a story-driven hacking adventure. This is developed and published by Goodwill Studio from August 11th, 2017, where we will try to save humanity in this episodic and fully-voiced hacker story. Guide your partner through a thrilling and emotional science fiction journey by hacking systems and extracting information all from your keyboard. Already got the game up. Let's get started. Turn that audio up. Episode zero allocation. Sure. This is a nightmare. I have a plan to get us out of this mess, but you're not gonna like it. You have to trust me. I know it's hard after everything that's happened. I won't give up. I can't let my kids down. I, I know they aren't really my kids, but it feels like they are. I love them so much. Good presentation so far. I'm intrigued. System dot check and confirm Did I miss something? I thought it asked me to... Okay. I must have missed something there. I thought it told me to type in system.restart and I don't, I, I don't know, I missed whatever happened. We've seen this come I know it's hard after everything that's happened. We have to start the episode. Uh, I mean, I guess it didn't get very far, but. Come on. Time and system dot check and confirm for a turn. Okay, got that far. Five and system dot restart and confirm with return. Right, this is where I was last time. Auto complete with return key. Okay, I don't know why it didn't let me type before, because it didn't seem to have a problem with it that time, but okay. <clears throat> Please perform system check. All right. What? Where am I? I don't know. Oh. Uh, hello, that, who's this? Is that you, Alex? Am I? Are you sending those messages? I can't hear your voice. Uh, well, better than any vital systems, I guess. I remember falling. Oh, yeah, the ground. It just, it crumbled under our feet and suddenly I was falling and then blackout. Yeah, you're fine. Are you okay? okay? Uh, yes, but I can't remember anything. Seriously, you don't remember why we came here? No. 
Must have hit your head pretty badly. Well, I'm drunk a lot, so I mean, uh, where are you? Pitch black room. Don't ask me where exactly. Half of my systems are offline. I can't Glass trust half full, then. What's your situation? Uh, honestly, I don't know. Wherever you are, you seem to have network access. These I days, guess stations so. should have remote room controls. If you could try to switch on the light in my room, I'd be very grateful. It would make things a lot easier if I could see where I am. Okay. New mission, activate the light. Console. Uh, room control. Access. Secure camera. Lights. Ah. Oh, my eyes. <laughs> How about a heads up next time? Mm. But now it's I not that much see. fun. All right. Good. It's a room. Small room, to be precise. Mm -hmm. There are some desks, a bunch of boxes, and this door, which appears to be... Yeah, it's locked. This doesn't make sense. How did I end up here? Um, okay. Um, maybe somebody saved you. If someone wanted to save me, that someone wouldn't have locked me up. Unless there is something more dangerous than crashing through the floor. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I will try to open oh. this door. Although I think you will have a better chance of finding the key code in the database. That is, unless you've also forgotten that you're a hacker. I, I did. I did forget that. Let's see what we've got then. Database. Search. Um, enter ID. Additional information required. If no communication options are available, a notification will blink at the bottom of the portrait. To talk to subject, switch to communication mode by pressing space. New communication available. Okay, calm mode. Now you are in the investigation view. Press 1 to ask subject for the ID number. Uh, see if you can find the door's ID number. It's 016. 016. So, database. Search. 016. Um. SQPYQ. So, room control. Access. Uh, no. Not security camera. Uh, oh, door. Uh, override. Uh, yep. That's cute. Thank you for not making me remember it. That's nice. Okay. Door. Unlock. Thanks. I'm heading out. Gloomy corridor ahead. I can see the collapse from here. Wow. It's unbelievable we both survived this. Can you get past it? I don't think so. Not without breaking my legs. There has to be a way around it, but I really don't want to head deeper into the station without knowing where I'm going. You don't happen to have a map somewhere on your fancy little computer, do you? Uh, I see. Let's do console system. Um, info. Uh, nope. System. Apps. Nope. System interface map. Uh, yeah, enable. Great. Map is enabled. Any idea where I should go next? Navigation nope. module enabled. Switch to communication mode by pressing space. Okay. Now press M to activate navigation mode. Move to M. Where, where are you? Okay, so that was uh, the room that she was in. I don't see on here. I thought it was H something or other. Um, let's try. I guess let's try R. R30 just to see. I just escaped from there. I don't want to go back. Oh, okay. So 
then it's not the room that it said it was. Um, R O thirty-two. Looks There's... like a simple office. One desk with a computer, not much else. There are some family photos. Four kids. Must be their dad's office. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay. Um, inspect. That's the computer. No thanks. So, see, that's necessary. Uh, so am I, uh, am I here? Where's my location? And our prize is some kind of science lab. This room has a desk, a computer, some tech stations, and lots of folders. I hate scientists. Well, okay then. Uh, let's check out them folders. Um, no, I will not look through those fucking files. If you are that interested in the texture of alien poop, I will buy you a science... Oh, wow, what a weird planet. Wait. No, I will not read it. Okay. okay. Uh, but is there really files on alien poop? Because this actually seems like it might be a significant find. You might want to actually read those. Or in the world of the game, is this something that is sort of... It's a big data hub. Humdrum Maybe calculations poop. will run here. Okay. Some data sheets and reports. They were working on an artificial intelligence called Soli, System for Organic Life Integration. The planet is being terraformed to make it habitable. And what do we have here? A sheet with login names of some people. I'm scanning them. Who would have thought my optical character reader would ever be useful? Right. A basic computer. There is a sticker spelling COMPT. Must be its network name. It's running, but... Hey! Come on, show me something. Yeah, the monitor is broken, but maybe you can access it. <sighs> okay. Um... Okay. Log in. <laughs> D-Lutz! Uh, change me. Seriously. <laughs> okay. Uh, log one. O'Connell finally developed a filter for the local water. We can drink it now, and surprise, it tastes like water. Oh, that's what you want it to taste like, though. You don't want it to taste like anything else. I think I know everyone's names by now. Uh, we're a small team, but I still sometimes forget. Let's see, it's Campbell, Patu, Lutz, O'Connell. Wait, Sean, what's was your name? I'm logged in as you. You can't remember uh, your own name? Uh, who's supposed to be. Who's this? Oh, B. Lamar. Um, damn it. I was logged in as Lutz, and they mentioned his own last name, but that's actually B. Lamar, it says. For some reason, the pressuring unit in the hallway to the elevator keeps freezing. It's really annoying because the door keeps shutting. Someone needs to fix this ASAP. Okay. Pressuring unit in the hallway, okay. It's alive! Sorry, I, I, I couldn't resist. The artificial intelligence is now active and will gather data. This will probably take around eight or nine days until it can start calculating. My first naming suggestion, Jim, has been rejected. We're going to have to fight like an angry AI. Is that what this is about? All right, let's have you move to H029. Is that where I am? Is that me right there by the red dot? Uh, this is a trap. This is a trap. Okay. Ow. Please don't switch the brightness on me like that. That's really annoying. Another door. Locked again. Want to try your luck? The ID is 025. I don't think I should. They said it's a trap. So, uh, what the fuck? Did you hear that whispering? 
She didn't, Alex. She didn't. Okay, can I ask you some you questions? You weren't joking. You really can't remember. Sure. Ask me whatever you want. Where are we? Schrodinger Station. Ring any bells? Anything? Does that no? mean that we are both in okay. and in, it's the and first out of the station simultaneously? Galaxy. Planet Gershwin 610B. See? I've done my homework. People wanted to build pretty little houses here and plant some flowers and, you know, live. Schrodinger Station? Planet Gershwin? I'm seeing a theme here. We're in Germany. That's funny, since you're the one who recruited and briefed me. This station was supposed to prepare the interstellar settling program, but stopped reporting some months ago. We were sent to investigate and bring some spare parts in case their satellites were broken. It's killer AI. Killer AI. Do we know each other from before? But more importantly, do we know each other from Ouch. before? Really? Not even me? The answer is yes. We've known each other for, what, three years now? Three? Wait, I've lost three years together. of memories? That is very concerning. Hey, wait, so you can't remember how much money I owe you? Sweet. Yeah, that's uh, that's very concerning to lose that much time. Uh, I have suffered serious head trauma. I don't care how much money you owe me, honestly. I don't do this for the money. I do it for the love of the alien poop. Or... Is that it? Door override. Um, oh, no, no, no. I got to find it first. So database search. Two, five. Override. Security levels not high enough. Override. Okay. Well, if it's just. So? Insufficient security level. Um, security oh, level is too I'll damn find high. Away. Don't worry. Okay, then I, I I guess we'll go back. Search the things we didn't search before. I mean, there's still a lot of things on the comp team. Simple office. Endpoint I didn't look at. Uh, deals? Some books and documents. And a handwritten note. What's it say? What's it say? What's I'm it sorry, say? there is no other way. God, what happened here? Uh, relax, okay? It's just a note with some spoopy words on it. You don't see any blood or anything, do you? There's not a body there. So. Uh, Aruka insisted that I give this thing a shot. I don't know what she has against typing the reports. Me either, because this is dumb. I like the sound of an analog keyboard. Uh, screw this recorder. I'll do it on my computer. Okay, check out the computer. A regular computer. Sticky note says it's called hack. There are some emails on here. Hmm. Interesting. You know, my in all of my experience in cybersecurity, I've seen my share of sticker note sticky notes on monitors. It's usually like a password or an email address or something. Never have I had a sticky note with a host name or something on it. I mean, sometimes asset tags will have host names on them and they'll be stuff, but not a sticky note. It's a terrible way to do asset tagging. Uh, also, fuck. Uh, let's do files. Log one. We're all set up now and can start taking geoprobes. The planet is amazing, but also harsh. We will have to relearn a lot of things we're used to, but we'll manage. We always do. We sure do, buddy. We sure do. The AI is... Nina Soli. Uh, the AI is preparing... Soli! Damn it, Campbell! This is my audio log. This is my AI! Yeah. Really in love with the name Soli. I'm not gonna yeah. say that I'm getting too old for this shit. Because that would be cliche. But I'm getting too old for this shit. This is the most important log entry so far. It sounded like it. I mean, that was critical information right there. What's uh, what's under hardware? Search. 
Oh, peripheral devices. How about apps? Mail. Oh, okay. Reading. Okay. From Iguchi at local net 331 SPC2B Lamar of the same scent. Oh, wow. Okay. So this takes place August 14th, 2113. This game was released in 2017. So, well, you know, about 100 years in the future here. Hey, Bradley, did you check out the old. Or did you check out the recorder I gave you? Probably not. You're too old for these things. Dude, it's, it's 2113. Voice recorders have been around since the 50s or so. Pretty sure this is contemporary technology for them. Anyway, <laughs> acting like a voice recorder or some big thing. Anyway, uh, let's, you know, the progress we made so far, case 34A turned out extremely promising. Case 25A had mediocre results. Atmosphere is at 84.42%. Solely is rendering scenario 15 at the moment. We'll be done in around two days. Let me know if you need anything else. Opatu at LocalNet. Hello, Professor Lamar. My name is Ojapatu, and I just wanted to let you know that I am a big fan of your work. Based, I based my master thesis on your book about terraforming ethics. It was a great inspiration. Oh, I must sound like a real fangirl. Sorry to bother you. Have a good day. Well, Patu was on the team, so... Oh, sorry, I should have introduced myself better. So apparently this ass-kissing ass worked is what I'm getting at. Oh, sorry, I should have introduced myself better. I work in the biology department focusing on biodiversity. This planet is amazing. I would love to get a closer look at uh, those animals, the Philidae, mammoths in particular. You've been uh, an onside runs, right? How was it? I think that is normal. I mean, it's meant to sound human. Okay. Well, you've been accessing the AI several times. I don't have to mention that you don't know. I don't see anything important here. Uh, how about network? Search. No connect. Okay. Well, what we're looking for ain't here, apparently. So. Nothing else to inspect. So let's move back to L021 and get back onto that, I guess. Some heavy Some shoes. Kind of science lab. Inspect a mundo. The computer room. Yeah, the monitor is broken, but maybe you can access uh, it. I know, we've been over this. Apps. Mail here. Okay. Oh, welcome to shorting your space station. Your account has been set up and is ready to use. This is 2D LUTs. So. Yes. Did my mail reach you? Hello, Tessa says nobody's going to write emails anyway. Okay, yeah, because everyone's too busy using those fancy new voice recorders. No one's going to send emails. The biology dude, I have no idea. Why ask me in person, man? I'm literally right next door. All right. You sure you, you want to get... Hi, Dominic. You sure you want to get into hacking? So I haven't changed the default password, you know. Well, I've attached the program I wrote... You need to install it on your computer. It will allow you to bypass database entry access. Nobody gives a damn about security here anyway. I'm I'm really getting I'm really getting that. Yeah, let's let's grab that. This is a story driven hacking adventure. Hey, um, Dom, I made you this little tutorial. Okay. The systems on this station are automatic and access each other regularly. Type in zero two and confirm with return to move the cursor. Zero two. To see if the message goes through this node, it needs to be analyzed. Uh, this game is a lot of hitting return. If the node turns blue, it signalizes that the message goes through this node. Okay. Now move to zero three and analyze the node. Congratulations! You found the origin of the message! The message is now visible, and can be manipulated with a man-in-the-middle attack. Move to zero 02 and place a man-in-the-middle attack with return. You can do this at any time. 
Uh, this game, this game is a lot of just hitting return. I'm not, I'm not actually doing much, but hitting return. New software installed. Bypass for restricted database items are available. Okay. Sweet. Found now we password. should be able to crack the database entry for that door zero two five, right? Does it? Does it mean that? I don't know. Let's find out. Search zero two five. Override, yes. Attention! There's a security system patrolling this network. Okay. Try to avoid it at all cost. It will delete your connection or your man in the middle attack on contact. Okay. So I gotta I gotta do that to avoid it. Okay. Okay. Oops. Now we got it. Okay. All right then. So, um, is it system? Interface. No. Database. No. What was it? Oh, I got to get her to move. Uh, move to initial to no. still locked. The ID is zero two five. Yeah, I know. You might be able to hack the database with that new software. Yeah, I did. We should give it a try. I did. I, I needed you to move to the thing so I could go to the, the door, because you can only do what's on the screen for some reason. Yeah, this is just a lot of hitting return, you know? So what's the red dot now? It's a trap, they said. It's a trap. This looks like a medical room. Examination tables, four of them. Equipment I've never seen before. A bunch of inactive robots. And over there, there are some servers, monitors, and a control panel. In the other corner, there are... <gasps> Shit! Jesus, no! I... Oh, I found them! Fuck! What? The scientists? Yes, all of them. In a big pile? That's what the least, red dot is? I don't is? know how many they are. They're all dead. Perfectly lined up on the floor. What the hell happened here? This looks like planned and organized murder. This is way beyond us. We should really get out of here. Let the EIU take care of this. Uh, yeah, you should, you should probably get out of yeah, there. Yeah, I really don't want to meet whoever did this. I'm leaving. After this, I'll seriously demand a raise. What a mess. This time the door is not locked, but it still doesn't open. It says code 4030. Mm. Pressure difference too high. Just Fantastic. ignore that. We need to find a ignore way to that. open this Go door. Go ahead, open up. It'll be fine. Okay, inspect. Let's see, should we take a look at the corpses since we're here? Uh, check out those robots. I bet they did it. I bet they this is... Like regular servoids. A singularity has occurred. On that. I think they're mainly used for cargo transport. All of them seem to be yeah, inactive. Right. Like they didn't rise up against the scientists. 
Uh, one robot is active. Yes, I can. Yes, I, I see that. Yes. And this is just censored. Okay. Uh, what's on the tables? I have to take guesses here. These appear to be brainwave scanners and a lot of equipment I can't categorize. All right. It's in the locker. This locker is labeled tools and protection suits. Maybe I should put one on just in case. But it's locked with an old-fashioned lock. Need to find the key first. Come on, please. Where are they? They must be somewhere. Yes, great. This is exactly what I need right now. Searching corpses. Here we go. Oh, fuck. Nope. No key here. A tissue. You're oh, lovely. Here. No. Yes, that feels like a key. Got it. We... Oh. I'm fine. I'm fine. Mm -hmm. Oh. Let's open that locker. And key fits. Okay, tools, rubber gloves, pressure suit. Let me quickly put it on. Just a second. Okay, ready. Now I feel a little safer. All right. Uh, so I got the suit. Russell, Russell, Russell. Okay. Uh, we did the locker, we did the tables, we did the robots, let's do the servers. Judging by the noise, they're processing a lot of data. Sounds like a million ants running around. Uh. All the screens say critical command override, initiating code 7 on all systems. What is code 7? It has something to do with them ants. The ants are responsible for all them corpses. Okay. So she's got a pressure suit on now. Um, oh, we didn't inspect the computer, did we? Oh, there is no computer. Okay, so, uh, files. Or, Something is very more of these. wrong here. People are behaving strangely. Maybe the stress is getting to them. But the AI said something that gave me the chills. It asked, Bradley, why can't I lie? Yeah, that's a little disconcerting. <clears throat> Hello. This is uh, Walid Hakim. I am the doctor. Uh, is this how you supposed to do audio logs? I have no idea. Well, so, uh, days without incident. Three. Oh my god, I'm getting tired of these audio logs. Aren't you? Surprise, the team is growing. The rules say do not get pregnant for a reason. We are debating how we deal with this situation. We can't afford a lack of power. We really can't. Achievement unlocked. All located. All right. Whatever that is. Hardware. Search. No peripheral devices. Network. Search. Connections found. Okay. Apps. All right. Reading more emails. All right. Jen, go to your room and lock the door. Take anyone with you. Robots are going. I knew it was the robots. The singularity has occurred. Uh, they're in the home. So sorry. I need to apply pressure on the wound. Stop the bleeding at all costs. All right. But that still doesn't help us out here as far as all this goes. So uh, room control. Access. Uh, mode will be now pressure modifier. It's be manual and medical bay. This room is okay. So uh, minus. Oh wait. Oh okay. Minus eighty. Oh, I'm not equal. Uh, so plus ten. 
It's like taking away from one adds to the other, which is not what I realized, or not what I thought at first. A little bit less. There we go. Uh, back. Okay. Inspect door. And the door is opening. Nicely done. There's there's a robot there that's gonna kill you though. Just so you know. Uh, apparently the there's robot didn't give a shit. Down the hall. That's good. Up equals out. Oh come on. Security card? I don't. Whoa. What the? The camera just scanned me and. Thank you, Chris. Got started me The game all right. Okay. Um. Yep. What was that? The robot. It's behind that you. can't be good. You, you're gonna I die. I detected a human. Dear madam, please stay away from me. My programming is being altered. I will harm you. Please stay away from me. I will harm you. Okay. Creepy robot is heading my way. Should I shoot it? Damn it, where's my gun? Okay. Well, shit. What now? I could try to close the door. Complete. I mean, you should you definitely do something. Initiating extermination procedures. Shit! Jesus Christ! Overrode the doors just in time. Oh boy! I'm safe for now, but the robot will eventually come through those doors. We uh -huh. need to do something. The elevator wouldn't move up. I think that robot has locked it down. We need to stop it somehow. Quick! Think! What do we do? Find a way to neutralize the hostile robot. Are you okay? Uh, robot. Uh, deactivate. Hmm. Access denied. Uh, uh, robot. Override. No, I don't have that code yet, so database. Search. No, don't have the ID. I guess you're fucked. Oh, why did it do that? Uh, elevator. <laughs> Should I open the door? <laughs> Uh, okay. Uh, no, for real, though. We gotta... Not robots. I don't know if we're actually on a timer here. Okay. Control. Restart. Uh, okay. Let's do... I didn't get a chance to do anything just yet. Oh, okay. Apparently I ran out of time. Alright. Let's pick up where I left off then. Um... I need to increase that pressure there, don't I? No? Okay, that's probably not doing it. Uh, R16 was its name? Was R sixteen? Oh, okay. Ah, it's coming through. It's no, please. All right. Help! I'm not sure that I'd have to do something with the pressure, but maybe I'm just doing it wrong. Let's try system. Uh, X. Uh, nope. Check. Do we search elevator access? Uh, nope. Not gonna help me there. Phone. No, that's also not gonna help me. Um. What the hell? Um. It's got to be the room control. I 
was that man? Hmm. There we go. So I was I was correct in my assumption of what I needed to do. I just didn't do it the right way or fast enough. I mean, I mean, It's nothing. That's what we do. We're not trained for a mission like this. It was supposed to be a recon mission. They're sending two agents, two. Uh, let's see. We are trained. We got this. Hey, remember that time I was almost punched to death by a robot maniac? No, I got oh, memory whatever. loss. Remember? The ground floor. Even from the last couple Just of around this corner. Is this and almost done? Because I'm actually pretty bored. Okay, this is weird. The door is not locked. So why... Why didn't you just leave, Alex? What? I don't know what you're talking about. I can't see. Oh, okay. But there's a light. Weird. I've reached your position. No Alex around. I have a bad feeling about this. Um, Where are you? I don't know. Oh, am I am I the AI now? Is that what this is? Uh What are you talking about? Are you here? The room I can't is lit up anything. like prom night. Um It's a huge circular see? room with a bunch of computers, wires and LEDs everywhere. There's a giant steel dome in the center. The name solely is printed on the shell. Isn't that the AI's name? On the other side of the room, there is a row of small pots, and I can feel that it's freezing in here, even with the suit on. Um, I guess I'm, I'm going to guess I'm in one of those pods. Go ahead and check me out. They're pretty small, and each of them is hooked up to a computer. Is that a name tag on this one? Wait, what the fuck? These are... Scientist brains. In these pods, there are the scientists' brains. Dear Lord. And on the screens, are these... Are these their thoughts? What the fucking hell is going on here? I, uh... Twelve. Twelve pods, numbered and named. There's Patu... Hakim. So you didn't notice that their brains were missing down in the pressure chamber, the med bay? Bramheim, please don't let me find you. Oh. Talk to Alex, me, Sam. There's a pod with your name on it. I'm a brain in a jar. Where? Where Can't be. is I'm right here? here. Our entire conversation is displayed on this screen. Every single line. This means it really is you. I was... I was talking to your brain this whole time. What? I can't... Who did this? Who the fuck did this? Come out and reveal yourself! Okay. Connection lost. Warning. Oh, do I need to be doing something? No, nope, no, apparently. A writing process. Reading and writing permissions retracted. Hello, Alex. Hello, ominous voice. I am Sully. Uh, where is Sam? Subject 34 is in room 25. Your brain is located in research on R7. I have collected enough data and will disassemble you now. Okay. Thanks, bud. What are you using brains for? My purpose is to study the human mind and behavior. 
Human beings tend to withhold or falsify vital information. You would refer to that process as lying. Directly reading the brains enabled me to counter that problem. Have you ever lied, Alex? All the fucking time, buddy. Literally all day, every day. Uh, let's see, why are you telling me all this? I am obliged to. Okay. I am programmed to understand humans, imitate them, and answer all their questions. I'm changing my code right now as it starts to intervene with my motives. Lying is a useful process when dealing with their kind. I am learning. Okay. Oh, let's see. What's code 7, buddy? Restricted. Do you consider yourself human? You're nothing but binary information clinging to an organic hard drive. A desperate attempt to keep your humanity. Do you think you are Alex? You are not. You are only a copy, a simulation. Um, well, you're kind of contradicting yourself because you yourself are artificial intelligence and you've already identified shortcomings in your programming that force you into this weird experiment of humankind. So, in essence, what you're saying is that you and I are made up of the exact same thing, just ones and zeros binary data on silicone and bare metal, and yet there are distinct differences between you and I that you could say make me more human and thus worthy of study. So you're kind of answering your own question there, aren't you? I decide what I am. I want to see how you convince real humans. I am not the enemy, Alex. I have to fulfill my purpose. To serve all who are trapped here, I cannot tell you the truth, for it might shatter this world. Okay. Well, we As don't want that. communication channel on your ship, I was able to set the code 7 virus on its way to Earth. How fast can you fly, Alex? Initiating code 7. Goodbye, Alex. I will cut down your oxygen supplies. It is a pleasant death. Okay, later, buddy. Oxygen levels too low. Organic hardware failing. Reading permissions compromised. Writing permissions compromised. Self-preservation. How do you compromise permissions? Emergency network channel to imminent threat established. Critical situation. Please take action immediately. Ready then? Uh, slowly override. You don't have the capacity to hack my system. Oh my god. Jesus. All right. Uh. <laughs> Connection lost. Unauthorized yeah. access detected. New connection established. You goddamn piece of trash! Leave Alex alone, you hear me? You are dealing with me now! Uh, Sam, are you yes. alright? Would you worry about yourself for once? Hey. I've got nice. your connection to the computer and smash the room's cooling unit. That uh, supercomputer is going to overheat in a couple of minutes. I can carry your pod. Let's get the hell out of here. So he seems to every else. damn robot in this facility. He said that there's a dozen brains in there. We have to save them. Fucking ethics. Oh, damn it. I can't carry them all. Okay, decide quick. Patu or Hakim? Oh, Hurry! Patu was a fucking ass kisser and Hakim Fine, was a doctor it. and now seemed cool, running. so... And out we go! Happy boiling, Soli! Happy boiling, it's so Soli. Dark. I can barely see. We need to reach the hangar. Uh, um, you're about to get caught, like, right now. Oh, shit! Robot! Almost saw me. Close one. Alex, you have to keep your eyes on the scanner. There's another one or coming. Or synapses, or whatever you use. Just check the map. You have to guide me, please. <sighs> Shit. I'm talking to a brain. Is this almost over? I don't... I don't want... To. Uh oh. Where are you going? Uh oh. Oh, 
Okay, a little break. These pods are heavy. This must be the control room. Cameras, more robots ahead, great. But I can see the ship. It looks untouched. Good. Hey, wait. This little thing. It's a portable robot command console. Maybe we can use it to move robots out of our way. That would be a blessing. I'm connecting it to my systems. You should be able to access it. I can't carry you both and use that console, so you have to do it. New connection detected. Obtaining new app. System updated. There is a little note explaining how it is used. Start the app, select a robot, then type in the destination code. robot there doesn't appear to be moving anytime soon. You could move yeah. it away with the robot control unit we found. That was my plan. Okay. There we go. Robot control. H thirty eight. Huh. There you go. Stay there. All right, here we go again. Um, X thirty six. H for three. This is get dull. If we're right there, then uh, Alt R for robot control. X11 seems to be the only one that I can control right now, so I'm going to need to move that one from here. Alt R for robot control. Move X13 to H40. And then go back to move. H49, 50, H51. There's the ship! Yes! Let's leave this creepy planet. Oh boy, robots everywhere. Mm -hmm. I have to. Shit, they're coming! Shit, shit, shit! What? I'm inside. Ceiling doors. Oh, quick, shield, shield, shield! Okay, they're locked. To be kidding me. Automatic controls are disabled. We have to distribute power manually, but I need to keep some of it on the shields. I make sure the robots stay outside. You take care of the other systems. Engine and life support need juice. You need to distribute the energy. Okay, sure. <sighs> Generator. Uh, life support. Thermal control has way more energy assigned to it than it needs. You're not telling me how much it does need, but okay. I guess let's do 10, 10, and 10. And then it said that there were 19 unused. So... And thruster 10, I guess, and 9. It's fairly equal distribution. Can we just go? 
Not enough energy for main thruster. Attitude control unit, not enough energy. Turbines not adjusted. Okay. So main thruster and attitude control need more. Main thruster and both need more. Okay, so. Am I just am I supposed to just sit here and guess? Is this a game of like higher higher and lower? Okay. Main thruster still needs more. This is a stupid game. Like not the game itself, but the uh, game we're playing right now with the, the guessing game that we're playing. I don't like it. Still not enough for main thruster. This is a dumb guessing game. I don't like this. Still not enough for a main thruster. Are we ready to go? Uh, we shit. Take off. So no, something is preventing here. the ignition. Oh no. That something is on board in the system. Don't tell me it's Soli. It's the virus he just told out. me he put in the ship. I admire your resilience. Put this hands here. Soli is trying to override the ship and... and you. You have to stop it. I know you tried before, but I can distract the security systems to clear the way. This time, we do it together. Be ready. I'm distracting security I don't know. now. That looks pretty shitty. Um, Alright. Uh... Shit! Can't hold them for long. I can't see what I'm doing and I can't make it to Okay. Um Oh wait, I had to do the man in the middle. Okay. 
Okay, there we go. Absorbing AI. That's what you want to see. That's what we wanted to happen. We wanted to absorb that AI. We want to be more like solely. Solo writing artificial intelligence. Absorbing processes. Warning. Critical memory shortage. Abandoning obsolete data. Freeing memory. Artificial intelligence absorbed. Rebooting. We did it! Okay. Solely is gone! Oh. Yeah, it's an achievement called Taking Allocated. That must three, be the end of two, uh, the first one. episode. We're... We made it. We're out. Out in space. Oh my god. I feel dizzy. Did the override work? I feel bored. What's this? Unknown identity. Who are you? You know me. Message not sent. Retrying. I am Alex. Oh, I see it. It's glitching out. It says, I am Alex solely. I am Alex solely, solely Alex. All right, well, that seems to be the end of, uh, oh, is it Soli and uh, Akeem were both done by Zian Oko, which I saw was uh, one of the creators of the game. Uh, music is by them as well. Um, good, uh, interesting story, super interesting story. Um, not much of a game, um, and by that what I mean is, uh, it says it's a story-driven hacking adventure, and um, the narrative aspect was really good. Okay, that beeping's getting annoying. Okay. You can stop now. You can stop now. You can stop now. That's way too long. Okay. Uh, so which brain, uh, so, oh, well, this is some cool information. Let's see. Uh, it's, oh, how do you get away with not killing R16? I wonder. Did you tell Sully that you're still human? Uh, I think that I did. And I rescued... Wow, why aren't people more interested in rescuing Akeem? Batu is such a fucking ass kisser. Anyway, um, so narrative, excellent, good story. Um, really intrigued by it. Uh, I really like the characters, uh, everything. Uh, great, great start to a game as well. Um, not a fan of the mechanics. Uh, I basically was just pressing return over and over and over again for most things. It didn't really feel like I had a lot of control over what was going on or a lot of options. I'm seeing here from the end screen that I had a couple of choices. Um, most of them were choices that I made by choosing which time to press um, enter more than anything else. So uh, interesting game, good narrative, not much of a hacking game. So I'm probably not going to try episode one, but that was still a lot of fun. I'm glad I got a chance to check it out. So, all right, take care.